And now Boutier is second in the first. Go in. Go in. Go in. Wow. I think she figured it out. What a shot. What a start for Boutier. It's going to be a kick in birdie to get her round started here at one. Hyun Chen, 33 year old from Taiwan, or third at the fourth. Now you really want to take advantage of the park fives out here. This fourth hole, one of the easiest holes on the golf course to this back hole location. Just go ahead and make it. In the red figures, one under celebration. Make history, do what Nancy Lopez did, Annika Sorenstam did win in five straight starts. Double bogey at one, the bounce back at two. So she starts. Battle back inside the cut line. And that will help. 30 at three is a good score. It can be a tough par three with that water guarding the front of the green. Davison here at 10. This for par. So Davidson at even par right now, trying to stay there. Just inside that mark. Yes, left edge. Or you could do the chunk and run and land it at the bottom of the tier and let it release back. Like that. That was well done. It's Madeline Sackstrom for a birdie at three. Oh, yeah. Well done. Bian Chen, she had the lead after the opening round last year. Shot five under on day one. Fell away, unfortunately, over the course of the championship. But that's what she likes to see. Rolling it in from long range. And Karen, and the better she plays today, the later she plays tomorrow. Exactly. Stays right there. Great look from just behind. What a roll. She's going to hit a baby nine iron at this. The wind has switched slightly. It's now a little bit into these players' face. If you aim this four yards right at the flag, it will catch a slope. Oh, it stopped. It stopped. It's not going to catch it. Oh, it's going to be a really quick putt now for Nelly. This is a par putt now for Nelly. Yeah, no problem at all there. Just a little unlucky that that didn't release down the slope. Concentrating on professional golf and tour life. Cheyenne Knight just over a little ridge there down the hill. 15. Well done. Cheyenne playing in her home state of Texas, so she'll have some good support. And she's got 101. And a 54 in hand. Yeah, she had a beauty in here yesterday, Karen, to a few feet. Just outside of the few feet here. And there's just really love how comfortable she looks over the putts now. Mm. Yeah, Karen, I think that's the biggest difference in her game. She just stands over a putt and looks like she knows she's going to make it. And if it doesn't go in, it, it does that. It, it looks like it should have gone in. This is Amy Yang over at the 17th. Amy's had all pars today from this point and make that one a birdie. So it takes her one under par for the day. Started her round from the 10th. Got to land it right on the edge. Deep in that Bermuda, have to hit it almost like a bunker shot. Well done. No, not to be. The poor tee shot from Nelly there. We. Uh, we're expecting that. It's going to be a drop shot. Not plain sailing. It just landed a little bit past where she wanted to. Yeah, look, look like it. More of a dying speed than a force in the hole putter. She is, Karen, but I'd say lately. This is G.A. Shin in the field here. She's been playing on the Japan LPGA Tour, a player that has graced the top of the world rankings before. And she is uh, trying to make the Korean Olympic team, which is why she's playing a little more on the LPGA Tour. She 
set up quite a bit left, almost like that TV tower, Karen. Just nice to fade. There it goes. Looks good. What a shot. That is really good. Not an easy one to get right. Oh, she got it spot on. That was just so good. And Nelly gets the five under par within one of the lead here at the Chevron Championship through nine holes. Like the signal flash was for an eight iron. Yeah, that's some good teamwork there. Jason, knowing Nelly well enough to say, to back her off that seven iron, say, no, the eight is perfect. And for her to trust him enough to say, okay, and I'm going to fully commit to this shot. You're right, Terry. It has picked up just a smidge just in this part of the course. But I think the humidity is, is a lot greater than it was yesterday. And I know it was pretty humid yesterday, oh. but today it just feels so heavy. Karen, that was I right know. there. Right She's there. rolling it so well. One more rotation of the golf ball. To go out. And she's going at it. Oh, wonderful shot. And Nelly. So it'll be smooth with this stroke. Oh, turn it just a bit more than she thought. Still, it's going to be a par for Nelly. She'll remain one back. Coglin, you tee off at 12.15 local time, 1.15 Eastern, those times you can see on the leaderboard, Eastern time. Uh-oh. Yes. Awesome shot. a bit of the tail of the day six of 11 greens so far today for after we're touting her iron play and here's the draw great shot all right good chance to get one there and get it to three over par initial slope to the that will take the ball to the left as well it's off that front bunker Morgan, every single putt of length, if it doesn't go in, it's right there. Every single putt that she's hit today just has looked really solid. The only one that really didn't look the same down and through it was her par putt on seven. Didn't quite keep the putter as low through the ball as some of the other putts that she's had, but... Squeeze that steering wheel a little tighter. <laughs> It's not officially a putt because she was off the green, but it's good work done with the putter. And don't count Allison Lee out of the weekend plans just yet. Another birdie here on the back. She's got plenty of height on this. It's a good shot. Be good. Jason asking for it to be good right up the gut of the green there. Beautiful. That's beautiful. 277. That's big. It's the third hole. And then it goes Madsen for a birdie. Is this one going to drop? It's got enough pace. Yes, you knew it. <laughs> you knew it. <laughs> Never a doubt. <laughs> Good stuff. Par five. Want to take advantage here. Oh, yeah, she does. Getting better and better. Chance to get it to five under, one back. Three over par, battling away, trying to make the cut. And that one's on a good line, on a very good line indeed. Oh, three for Stamford. The eagle has landed there. And it gets her to one over par and inside of the cut line. The second eagle of the week at 13. Paula Rito at the 11th, her second. Another player trying to... Move inside the cut line. Not another player who holds it. And that moves her to two over par. Great stuff from Paula Rito. <laughs> yeah. So. The 
the bit of release that she's going to get from this fringe. She couldn't have landed that in a more perfect spot. Just can't really control how it's going to release, but very well done. Boy, she turned it on. On a roll right now. Birdie four of the last five holes. Got it to five under. And I think we're going to see more and more players finish up here as the greens uh, get firmer. Drying out as the morning goes on. Hate on you. Going to make a four at the par four fifth. <laughs> Nelly Corda in control. Six under. Second at 15. Yep. This one uh, perched on the front of the green here, Karen. It is. And she's got a wedge out from 121. I'd say yeah, it did really sprinkle, but I didn't up. notice any difference because it's so humid out here. Ah, maybe it's good that it uh, rained a little I bit. I liked it. 25 year old who lives on the Gold Coast of Australia, Karis Davidson. Lucky for the ball to finish there off the tee, but uh, wow, she's got some magic and another one goes in. No, no, don't take credit for that. It's been a while. Oh, okay. Third shot, excuse me. It's the magic from Pebble Beach. This at six. Oh, way right off the tee, just getting it back in position. But wow, she found an opening to get it on the green, Terry. What a shot. Can it stay there? Yeah, right on the edge. Who knows? It could hold it. The ball runs down towards the hole. She's got this a little right. Catch the slope. Could come back. Yeah, could come back from there. Here we go. Here we go. That's it. That's the way to do it. Right on cue. Madeline Sagstrom battling away. This is her fourth at the par 4 15th. And now has to negotiate what is a tricky hole. And that one. Oh, gets it to drop. That's so valuable. Yeah, she can't believe it. Her streak began okay. in a four major calendar year, and then having five has certainly accelerated that streak. I think just as impressive, 66 cuts made out of out of her 100 major appearances. Guys, guys. What a shot by Allison Lee. <laughs> Part of the afternoon wave, Lindy Duncan from the lower level at the third, where we've seen some players have success today, and there's another one. So that gets Lindy to three under par for the championship. Not really go at this flight because of the bunker, so just to the right portion would be perfect. It's a four. She likes it. I mean, when you think about this pairing, and, and Nelly hasn't been distracted by what has been going on around her in this group either. And she talked about staying in her bubble. She has done that. Yeah, this would be one you'd be looking to chip in. Thought about it. Tap in there to get it to six under though and share. <laughs> yeah, I missed the jackhammer earlier this morning. <laughs> Nice solid swing by Brooke. Who likes that one? Chase down to here. One thirty eight to the flag. Really good. Keeps getting better. He's five or six yards short of the pin, even with a wedge in hand, because it's going to kick forward. like that. Damn. Oh, yes. Not a bad leave anymore. Nope. This is Yan Lu just off the green. Throwing it back there, and that's just confidence yes. there. That is wonderful. And she's battling away to try and make the cut. Now, I mean, Katsu has played well this week. Right there in the mix at four under. This her third at the par five. 
just over 500 yards today. And whole location, right on a ridge right there. Tough to get it close. Jin Hee-im here at the fourth, her second. The 25-year-old from South Korea making her championship debut, and she's right there. Yeah, it's pretty remarkable the way that she has played so far. And that fourth hole, definitely one for the taking. Tudakun here at the fifth with her second. Only got 115 to the hole, courtesy of a drive that carried the bunkers on the right. Looks very good. Yeah, back there on the lower level of the green. She's going to get it all the way back there. Oh, yes, yeah, she is. Having a little look at the hole. Good tee shot there. there should be another birdie at number three. Go here. You know, it's all downhill. Let's see if she got the pace right. Not quite. So it's going to have that to stay tied for the lead. And Tai Tidikun ended up here. And not a bad place to leave it because she's chipping into the upslope. Uh. Oh, this is really high. It's on a really good line too. Shot back. I always see a player or two at a major championship, Morgan, be right there in the mix that you would not have expected. Yeah, she's playing some really solid golf and I mean, fairways and greens. That's really what gets it done at a major. Lengthy birdie try now at 16 for Lexi. Yeah, but if she can get it about three quarters of the way there, it'll then take the ridge on the way down. And finds it. That wry smile, like, where you been? And a share. You talk about hitting fairways and greens, but it has actually been this club. She is leading the field. Yeah. The last three holes. How about the putt she's made? She's leading the field in putting. Oh. And she's leading the field on the leaderboard as well. Three of them up there at seven under. Tidikun on the way, or second at eight. 177 to the hole, and it's just a tiny six. I think she's really in between clubs here. Yeah, not a bad lead. Funnel towards the back of the green, but... She's fighting a way to make the weekend. Yeah, well done. That gets it to two over par, and she's got that eighth hole, which is a great chance for another birdie. At the ninth, the tie to Dukun. Second. Well, she set herself up nice with just a little wedge. It's 102 yards. Yeah, quality ball striking. Good to see her back here. Difficult looking putt here too with the read. Yeah. A few greens are really tricky to read. But she's in the hunt to win a major title for the first time in her career. She's won a couple of times on the LPGA. Four wins on the ladies European tour. She came really close to winning last year in that marathon playoff. It's right on the number right now. Give herself some breathing room here. Look at this shot. Maybe a lot of breathing room. Could get her right back in this championship. She was going to be tied for the lead. Oh, the biggest difference has been the putting compared to so far this season. That's a beauty right there. But I mean, to this point, she has 50 putts. 25 putts each day. Well, that's where it comes to what we talked about, you know, Soyeon being so hard on yourself. You do leave the golf course and you can kind of beat yourself up about what oh, could have been. Shin Bong, knocking that one in. And right there, starts going down the hill. Oh. I know what the call should be. I'm not going to go there. What a putt. For Eagle.